the most exciting thing about this new drone is that you can do whatever you want with it, smash it all over the place with all your crazy experiments, and it'll survive. It's equipped with an Intel Aero board, which you can program through Simulink, and therefore be able to implement any type of controller you can dream of and still have it fly. That functionality, that open architecture I call it, has always been important for us from the perspective of education. Because uh, when students interact with something, they, they, they want to know the fundamentals of it. We want them to learn the fundamentals of it so that they can design things from the bottom up. This drone was designed by a multidisciplinary team that took into account a lot of the elements here. We have, first of all, mechanical engineers, electrical engineers, controls engineers, software engineers, um, aer aerodynamicists. It takes a lot of skills, but we are, we're very lucky that uh, these skills are now becoming um, more coalesced into engineering you know, education in general. So you're not becoming just an engineer these days in a specific area. It's better to become a generalist than a specialist.